crash in New York City. He was 73. Simon was a longtime correspondent for 60 Minutes. His award-winning career spanned more than 45 years through major overseas conflicts since the 1960s. CBS New York City affiliate reported the crash took place on the city's West Side Highway alongside the Hudson River. Authorities say Simon was the passenger in a car that lost control and slammed into another vehicle. CBS News Vice President Chris Licht called Simon a true legend and said the tragic loss of Bob Simon is heartbreaking news for the entire CBS family. Simon joined CBS News in 1967 after serving three years as an American Foreign Service officer. He is originally from Bronx, New York and graduated from Brandeis University as a history major.